Welcome to News USA Today, where we bring you the latest in trending news about America. If you are new to our channel, please hit the subscription button and turn on the bell icon to get our latest updates. House Republicans will fail to convince the public that federal scrutiny of Donald Trump is unwarranted, according to former U.S. Attorney Joyce Vance. Incoming House Judiciary Committee Chairman Jim Jordan of Ohio and other Republican lawmakers have suggested that they will pursue aggressive investigations of the FBI. We've been looking at a church-style committee to look at this, Jordan said during a recent interview, referring to a Senate Select Committee that was convened in the 1970s to investigate abuses of power by intelligence agencies. But Vance suggested during an MSNBC appearance on Sunday that the upcoming investigations would do little to distract from Trump's attempt to overturn the 2020 election. Good luck with that, she said. If the goal here is to engage in some sort of a political statement-making process trying to tag the FBI with failures for whatever reason, whether that be claims of bias during the investigation or claims of failure of inaction ahead of the January 6th insurrection, you know certainly there will be issues, as there always are. Law enforcement can always learn, there are always after-action reports that help us do our job better the next time. But ultimately the American people I think have now been activated to appreciate the fact that blame is, as the committee says, for what that happened on January 6th rests with Donald Trump. Without him, none of this would have happened. This happened because the former president was a sore loser, Vance said. So for this new House led by Republicans to come in and try to cast blame elsewhere, I think it's a strategy that may be a nuisance in the short term but that will backfire on them in the long term because Americans are smart and now that we have the information that we can use in front of us a majority of us will see the truth here. Thank you for watching, smash that like button, leave a comment if you enjoyed watching, and share the video on your social media. Please follow and subscribe to News USA Today, and hit that notification icon.